good Wednesday evening. I'm Julia Espinosa at the First Alert Weather Center, and we have been seeing a very common pattern morning clouds with afternoon sunshine thanks to those gusty northwesterly winds. And the pattern remains as we continue this work week. So here's a look at your future cast model. We are seeing those low hanging clouds right alongside the central coast. The marine layer expected to continue to build as we go towards our overnight hours, and it is going to be bringing us more fog, more of those low hanging clouds, but precisely to those areas west of Santa Barbara along to those areas down south. For the city of Santa Barbara, it doesn't arrive until tomorrow early morning. And nonetheless, that activity quickly clearing away to another sunny afternoon. So beautiful conditions stick around in the forecast. We are tracking a broad trough in our region and it sweeps across our area continuing towards tomorrow. So for that reason, we keep our temperatures mild. We could be seeing some additional cooling down south and then winds will be picking up by the afternoon. Uh, pressure gradients are expected to get stronger as we go towards your Friday evening once more. And for that reason, advisories could be warranted back into southern Santa Barbara County. Now tonight, we're not seeing any advisories in the forecast. Winds have actually diminished compared to the last couple of nights, which is great news. We get that much needed relief when it comes to those gusty conditions. Now here's a look Wednesday, 830 p.m. Still remaining for Gaviota, but it is not warranting those high level winds up to 45 miles per hour. It could remain below 30. By your Thursday morning, it is a calm start for just about everyone. We have a bit of a breeze over Paso, but it's not until the afternoon where the uh, winds do pick up 5 to 15 miles per hour, and we could start to see those sundowner winds back into our area with the potential for an advisory and for southern Santa Barbara County, and again as we go towards your Friday. Temperatures as a result look like this. Santa Barbara, you're staying pleasant, 72 degrees, nice and comfortable. Carpinteria, you will be much cooler at 60 degrees as you get to wake up to more of that fog in the morning. Out in Buellton, we're expecting a daytime high of 70 degrees, while Vandenberg will be reaching 62. Near side of the beaches over northern San Luis Obispo County, we are talking upper 50s for Morro Bay, 56. But Avila Beach, you are looking milder, 65. San Luis Obispo, 70. And then we make our way back into Ventura County, where Ventura will be mild at 64. But Ojai will be warmer at 78 degrees. Still not too bad. That's a look at your forecast. Make sure to tune in tonight for the latest weather details.